Thank you for tuning in to Race Crews. New for 2017 are these Hot Wheels Minecraft track blocks sets. There's Nether Fortress and there's also Abandoned Mineshaft. Last year in the fall of 2016, Hot Wheels also released the Minecraft Gas Attack track set. Some viewers told me that it didn't make sense and didn't have anything to do with the game. I don't know myself as I don't play Minecraft, but as a Hot Wheels collector, it was a simple little track set to have fun with our cars. These track blocks are an interesting concept. As you can see, it's a square block, but then when you rotate the block on each side, it does a different stunt with your mine cart. They do come with some figures. I believe that's a skeleton. There's the Hot Wheels mine cart vehicle. This, I believe, is Zombie Pigman. And on bottom, I believe that's Blaze. The abandoned mineshaft is not a recolor of the Nether Fortress. It has its own design. However, it is the same in that you rotate to perform four different stunts. You have a Bat Basher stunt, mineshaft plunge, and uh, hey, gassed again, gassed blast. The first stunt they call Spider Slither. Here's the accessories you get in this pack. I believe that's zombie. You get a mine cart with that one as well. This is uh, some type of spider. And on bottom, we have a bat. The back of the box pretty much just re explains what they showed on the front. There you have for the abandoned mine shaft. So once you get your square, you're going to be able to turn it on the side, and then you'll have a different stunt. What's cool. It looks like we can connect the two sets together. You can tear open the sides if you want, but they also have this easier opening spot where you just push it and that'll tear the cardboard on the back. Get our finger in there, just slide it open. Well, that one wasn't exactly that pretty. Oh, it looks like it's mostly put together. Here's our instruction sheet with different ways to play. I don't know if this was easier or not. Oh look, it's pretty much already put together. I do have a few pieces to do. And I gotta get my uh, accessories out of the box as well. I have all the parts laid out. Let's take a look at that spider. He will be hanging on this piece here. I think if he gets bumped into by the minecart that he'll move. Now we have the bat. It looks funny like this, but he, he's like on top of something to hold him there. Now when this moves around, the bat's hanging. And so when you turn this in different positions, the bat will be hanging in different positions. Right here, he'll be hanging right above this road. And he's hanging in front of the road right there as well. You get these three pieces to hook on the side in these slots. That's if you want to connect the two sets together. I'll do that later. Or you can connect Hot Wheels track on the end of this as well. Here's your Hot Wheels mine cart. You just take your zombie, put him in the cart. This piece right here is like a brace. You use it in the back. It'll help your set stand up. Does it go this way or this way? It has this little leg, so that's supposed to go down or downward, I should say. Let's snap it in. Let's see, it forms a leg to help it stand up on its own. I don't think you have to use it because it stands up pretty good. But if you want to stand it up here, you put it right there, or you put it right there, or right there, or right there. There's the road that we're going to use to sneak past the spider. Oh, it didn't even touch the spider. Now we rotate. Mm, here's a road right here. And the spider's there as well. One more time. We move our bat over. Drop them in. 
Oh, he definitely hit the bat. And last time. Fell off. This one's a little bit better as far as being able to put your cart in. Now I'll go in reverse order since it's already here. <laughs> what happened, dude? Now let's put together the other one. The connectors on this one are purplish, like the roads, as opposed to the tan of the other one. And you get a stand as well. Here's your minecart and skeleton. I found that the Minecraft characters that have a sword or something uh, tend to have a little more difficulty getting them to stay in. Here we go. I'm going to start right here. Watch him. Oh, that was cool. He landed there back. Ping pong. Let's do it again. Oh, didn't work so good that time. Or is this supposed to be up here? No, it's supposed to be there because of gravity, right? Two out of three. Now let me rotate it this way. Now... Maybe it's going to hit him, but it looks like there's a pretty big gap. I don't think it's going to hit him again. Ooh, it's a jump. Oh, this one's simple. It's just a road to go across. Maybe I'll give him a help. Give him help. Oh, I see it hit him. And this way, I don't know, maybe go this way. You're going to land on his head. Bump, he's in jail. There's a little spot right here. I don't think he's supposed to go there unless I move this here. No, I don't think so. Looks like it goes straight down. You can see I put it in a connector. I think the second one at the top. We'll put it here so it's out of the way. And now they're going to line up. Give it a squish. Maybe I'll squish it right here to be better. This way I'm applying my pressure right in the area where the connector is. And I like, I like doing this one first because he's going to get a lot of speed and then go across this raceway right here. I can do both of them. Sit, go. Sit, go. Oh. So I like this straight away. I wonder if there's a spot to where we can have it come in the straight away this way. Now let's rotate it. Oh yeah, that's it right there. Let me go ahead and I'll do one. I'll just do one since it's right there, right where the connector is. That's the, that's the path he's going to take anyways. Here he comes. Boink. So if you're in Minecraft, is there anything like this in the game? I don't know. Let me see if there's another way to put it together. Let me take out this connector. Let's see, what else do we have? We had, uh, here's a race. Here's a race where it comes down, but then he lands. Well, maybe on top. I like this one. <laughs> Look, it's like a little whoop. But this is in the way. That won't work. 
on the back of the box. They show how you can connect it right here. I showed you that with the raceway and have it come down. They also show this way here, and I have that set up right now. You know what? I rotated these all sorts of ways. You could only put them together one of two ways, this way or that uh, raceway that I showed you. Let's try this. Yeah, that was not so good. By the way, these sets are about $20 each. Did you let me know if this is anything like the Minecraft game? I know a lot of people like to play it. Me, I'm a Hot Wheels fan. Maybe you're a Hot Wheels fan too. Do you like chicane? How about Nitro Tailgater? How about Fangster? Twin induction. And let's try Great Gatsby. Hey guys, you're in the way. <laughs> Zombie was holding him up. Timber! I forgot to put the leg on. I put one on, but I didn't put two. Oh, I was going to put it on and I didn't. Let's go ahead and snap them on and do it again. Come back. We'll do the Hot Wheels first. Uh-oh, he hit the bat. Excuse me. I don't know, $20 each. It's up to you. It's not something that I would buy myself, but you know, if you're a, if you're a Hot Wheels fan, maybe you like it. That's probably more for Minecraft fans than uh, Hot Wheels fans. Oh, this is another way. Actually, there's another way. I could go this way. I didn't even see that. Hang on. But even still, I don't like this way because you have to drop the car straight in. It's probably more for Minecraft fans. But, uh, you know, it's your money. You buy what you like and have fun with your toys. If you didn't see my original Minecraft gas attack track set review, there's the link. By the way, the Hot Wheels cars I used in this video, I used them in a track time presentation. You can check them out there. Thank you for watching and have fun with your toys. Bye bye.